Girl, you my little yeah, yeah. <laughs> Previously on part one. So if you missed it, go and check it out. Grown and sassy. Y'all, I got the rose Five. petals. Let me just give you this lingerie type vibe. <laughs> Talk to him. Mm. Learn him some. Next time we're gonna be in now robes. Might be about in day twenty five. Mm. Hey, won't you pin? Yeah. Hey. What? You okay, girl? Yeah, I'm too. Yeah, you gotta tighten up. Get your life together. Over there behind you, Penny. She smell it. Over there, go lay down. Over there, Penny. She, Penny. She, she, I don't yeah. want her to hit the camera. Oh. Go sit down. Here, yeah, Penny. Here you go. Oh, now who the hell gonna eat that? And she got three. Okay. Get in here. Bon Happy eggs. Uh. Yes, I'm looking like that because she's a spoiler brat. She's spoiled. Listen to her. Sound like a goat. I can't believe she ate that that fast. Girl, stop. Go sit down. That's it. Go sit down. Go lay down. Good girl. Y'all, she chewed that up like she was finna get some more. I don't know why she did that. She'll never take the time. Yes, she do. Not with me. Oh, she always nibbling dicks when I um, give her stuff. Cute mm. drinking the wine like his wife. Nope. What? She about to throw up or something. Mm -hmm. Why she just did that noise and just open her mouth like that? Anyways, that's why she woke up. <laughs> Today we didn't chill, y'all. We ain't doing nothing. There, shit, nothing. I know y'all like that. What we get nothing? This is what we getting into. Sipping wine, feeling fine, and being wrong. Mm -hmm. Relaxation. Getting a peace of mind. Because we grown over here. We don't do we don't do the childishness. Hey. Bye. Go sit down. Got a hairball or something? Hey girl, you better go drink some of the dang on water. Y'all wanna see Penny? I'm gonna let y'all see Penny, but not right now. She over there being fancy. I don't give you no cheese. I gave you some sauce. A little mustard. Yeah, a little mustard on one of them. Mm -hmm. Good. You know, show me. Anyway, well, like I was saying, y'all. When this is what we do. It's okay. Dang. You know what? Let's see. When you gonna take a picture of it? Well. We the first YouTubers that did something different. Came on here and they ain't do nothing. Well, we we at the bar. Yeah. We at the bar and we being grown yeah. and sexy. Yeah. And yes, he is. He was dressed earlier. Trust me. He came and oh, got yeah, undressed. 
And my baby was looking good now. I ain't shaving nothing today, but hey, it's all good. Don't get it twisted. Uh, yeah. I just rather stay ready. So that's just me. Or whatever. I didn't know we were going to vlog, to be honest. I did. Because we have to stay prepared. We got vlogs. But he didn't know. That's how we do it. Hey, I'm telling you, y'all should see. We got to start vlogging, like when we go places, like going out of town, oh, yeah, hitting sure. the road. I'm ready to start back doing that again. We used to be in, we skybox, skybox. You no hear cap. me? That's how we do it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so let's just in, just get in detail. <laughs> Um, since we were feeling a little romantic, hold on. But yeah, so just to open up a couple of questions that y'all might have been wondering about me and Q. Um, we met when I was 14 and I was 18. Lies. He was not 18. I was just about She's to turn 15. Fast, no, he made me be fast. So he was already experienced in the world. How you do that? You made me be fast. So he told me, I was chilling with him one day at one of his friends' house. And he was like, we was chilling and stuff. We were in the same classroom, you know, ninth grade. But um, he was 15 and I was 14. But yeah. He he asked me, was I gonna leave him like that? And I was like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like what? Because he mm -hmm. gave me a little smoochy smooch. And play a partner right here. You know. Finesse. He fumbled so and he, he, he touched down. Oh. He, he oh, fumbled wait, and touched no. down. What you call? I can't fumble. I don't fumble. So what happened? I just got the ball to run in like that. <laughs> I ain't know nothing about nothing or nothing. I knew nothing. Okay, period. Don't let that fool you. Okay. <coughs> he taking it to a whole nother level. But this was my first love. That wine finish got dang on. <laughs> but yeah, so yeah, we was um I was 14, he was 15, or whatever. And like I said, he was already experienced and he was like, You gonna leave me like that? Blah, 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 blah. So I didn't leave him like that, of course. So y'all be open your eyes to your 14 year old, 15 year old, because he might have a, a guy like him that's trying don't to- Don't want you to leave him like that. <laughs> <laughs> so y'all be- They gon', they gon'. Cause I'm telling you, cause you don't have to be fast in your household to be all over, you know, doing experiencing things. You could be one of them little sweet, humble little kids, yep. like I was. That was still having hair bows, but now by, by then I was going to the salon having my quick weeds done. Yeah, I, I didn't have no hair bows. No, I didn't. I was a kid. I was thick. You could have left me like that, then. Okay, I was thick. Well, not thick, baby. We're not looking good. I think it's deep. <laughs> <laughs> I was thick, y'all. Hips and everything, so. Like you is now? Yep. At 14, I was thick. <laughs> I'm talking about he what? was watching. I didn't know nothing about even my body that he was I, I, You know what I'm saying? I wasn't watching. You know what I'm saying? I thought she was watching. You know he was saying? watching. He was telling me about the, um, you know, stuff that I didn't realize that I had. And I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? That goddamn one. Yeah. For real. Yeah. You know, I didn't know because you know, like, right. no, I'm saying, like, I, you know, those pants, uh, hey, the, the, no, the gotchos. Don't, don't, don't I'm not gonna say, <laughs> I was hearing that if you if you wore gotchos back in the day, you probably got like four or five kids. I don't have four or five kids, but if you wore them gotchos back in the day, you already know it showed a lot. Okay, parachute pants showed a lot of like the MC Hammer pants. I used to wear those, I used to be cute, I still am, but I'm just saying. But yeah, so he used to call himself pushing a basket behind the door. What the hell a basket gonna do? Slow you down. It's not. Because if, if you go, if you open that door and then you hit that basket, you're gonna be like, oh, my bad. You're gonna think 
somebody's right there behind the door. So you gonna like, oh my bad. He's and so then you gonna, by that time you know got up out of that jet <laughs> and ran to the door. Oh, he's so smart. Like, What's up? Gotta be. He gotta had be he had y'all figure out. So y'all. What's up? Stop leaving oh, kids at home by themselves. Nah, I'm straight. All right. Oh. I would never. And go ever. pop right back in there. He was always prepared. He was always ready. Like had the, you know. Like you just said, you stay ready. You ain't gotta get ready. You he was always saying? ready, you know. So I wouldn't go into no stores buying no, you know, protection and stuff. Good thing he did, but yeah. You know what's the craziest thing is? I didn't think that we would make it this far, honestly. And he didn't either. I thought we were just going to be friends. She just wanted to smash and pass. I thought we were just going to be friends. I just had a really huge crush yeah. on him. But she, I didn't think she wanted that to smash it would happen. And pass and, and, and one, yeah, that, that goddamn one. Yeah. I didn't think it was going to happen because I ain't know nothing about no boyfriends or none of that. Because we were just Nobody friends. Stuff. We were just friends. Okay, period. What I knew about it? So how old were you when you had your first interactions with your other partner? Are y'all still together? Because this is 15, 16 years later and we are still friends. Oh, I don't You better cut it. Y'all see us. Stop. Hey, don't hey, pay hey. him no mind. Hey, don't pay him no mind. He is my best friend. Damn all. right. He's my best friend. We can make each other laugh. Damn we play right. and joke and job all the time. And that's my poppy. That's, right. that's my poppy, y'all. That's my world. <laughs> But yeah, so y'all let us know how old were you when you had your first experience and are you all still together? Because we are. We have all three children together. And the fun thing is, he asked me that I want to have his baby. I think I was like 15. I think I was 15. And I said, That's when you got dang on standing up in there, bro. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And then you're like, hey, you want... <laughs> Yes, I did. <laughs> you know, he's like, yeah. <laughs> Man, now, nah, young as hell. Thank you, knowing that. Don't know shit. Don't. Yeah. Three kids later. <laughs> and I was 23 when I had my first child, by the way. With that. With a ring. Well, I wasn't married. I got. No, I was 26. One. But yeah, the, the, I, well, we was married when we had our last child. And she's almost three. And she's four. All right. Get away with everything. Yeah. Start arguments in the house between me and her. Yeah. Cause that's my boo bug. I don't give a that's damn. That's my boo. That right she there. gonna say, you and my baby. Yeah. See, don't right do that. Mm -hmm. And she love lip gloss, y'all. Oh. She go to bed putting on lip gloss on the regular. I bet she about to wake up now. You done smoke up. <laughs> I want a lip loss. <laughs> a lip loss. But yeah. He did propose to me on Christmas. On Christmas. So that's what I was getting at. He proposed to me on Christmas and we got married July the 7th, 2017. It was an all white wedding. I'll put some pictures here and there so that y'all can see. But, um, we had a great day. That was a good day. It was. Yeah. It was. We were supposed to get married. Well, no, we were supposed to. I feel wrong when I got married. I'm like, what the I'm getting married? Why you getting married? Stuff you see on the movies. Coming up, well, me. I'm speaking for myself. Besides my grandma and granddad. They was married. My mama, she was married. Yeah. yeah. My mama, too, but... It was different. It was, yeah. It was different. Because the, the type of person I am to this day, like, yeah. We thought. It was like, damn near like the, you know, in the movies, you always got the good, you always got the good parents, especially back in the day, you got a good parent, the rich black folk. I mean, excuse me, not mean saying like, but them two, yeah. With some rich black people, yeah, too. Yeah, a lot of rich black people. But, rich, but they put more white. Nah, I'm not racing, not saying nothing. I'm just but saying. They, you see more white families. 
rich and famous and on TVs and the movies and stuff. Family. So a young black child, like, oh man. That's what you would like. Yeah. See, they, them, them dads, they be all perfect and they the best dad in the world. You got your soccer moms and you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, dang, that's what I want. If I be a parent one day, I'm going to be like them. I was a teen mom. But I'm better. I feel that I'm better than this. I don't know. We, I ain't of better course. than nobody, but I'm no, just saying. No, we were. Like, we we want to make sure we are the best parents yeah, that, yeah. We, that we had. Yeah. And no, we don't mean no disrespect. We just really want to be the best parents yeah. in the world. Yeah. So we do everything by every means to give our kids what we didn't have. And we had now. Yeah. Don't yeah. get me wrong. We had. We both yeah, were I straight won't, I won't. growing up. Yeah. But, you know, we had a lot of support back in the back, you know, back in the day. We don't have that now. So it's just, we support each other. That's all we do. So we all we have, you know, so our kids only know. Us, you know, in the household back in the day, everybody stayed with you. You know, your auntie, your grandma, your, your cousins, everybody stayed you know, with you. Everybody with stayed with you. So it was structured, but it wasn't structured how it is with a one on one parenting. You know, I'm a full time mom. He told me when I first, you know, when we when I had my first child because of stipulations um, with our kids, our first son, he didn't breathe when he was born, so he was had um breathing issues he was on a nebulizer for some years and then the second child she didn't she was premature so it, it made me a, a a better mom than you could ever believe that i was like seriously i stay home with my kids no more running the streets and none of that so i've been a full-time mother since i gave birth so past nine years i've been in the house and i don't mind because i'm doing what i'm supposed to do because then when you look at back at it you're like dang i missed a lot of stuff. But it was really just a lot of clubbing and stuff. And yeah. all that. Man, we, done, we did. We did. We had a good time young. growing up. Yes, we did. And we don't club. We do not say we won't go to yeah, club, but we yeah. do not club. We don't look forward to going out yeah. like we used to. Cause we spent a lot of money going into these clubs, going to buy VIP sections. Wait I'm so talking about paying other people ways, going on trips and stuff like that. Can somebody look out for us? I don't think nobody's going to do that for us. You know, it so ain't the point that we even looking for them and we're too. not, but we we, us, we, we spent yeah. a lot. We did a lot coming up. So mm -hmm. now it's time to invest in our property that we have. We want to invest in our business. We want to invest in us and our children. And we would like to invest in others as well because we have two music artists, which is 56 Nico and uh, St. Easy. So y'all go and check their channels out also. So we're, we're investing in a lot of important things now instead of Throwing money to the clubs and stuff. And if y'all need, if y'all need partnership, let us know. Let's sit down and talk. Hey. Serious inquiries yeah, only. Only. Yeah. But we don't give handouts. You got to work for it. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing free. Nothing at all. Yep. Nothing free. So. But yeah, that's it. Yep. We full used to. Mom. We have full time mom. He goes to work. He always told me old fashioned. Have the kids. You sit home. Make sure everything good. 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 A lot of dads ain't like that, and a lot of husbands ain't either. But I, I'm doing my part too now. Don't get it twisted. Yeah, she's still running I, the business. Yes, I'm still time. running my business. ShopNinaBoutiques.com. Talk your shit, baby. And <laughs> I'm running this channel. Okay. Yeah, because so, I'm just a special guest. Yes, he's a special guest I'm here. Part time. <laughs> he's part time. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> You got me. My grandma told me before she passed away, God rest her soul, our beast. sweet angel, Diane McGee. She it loved it blue. <laughs> yes, she loved blue. To grandma. To grandma. Grandma Diane. Grandma Diane. She you? told me, the world will need to see me. The, the world, world need to see me. And I'm going to make sure that I fulfill that dream that she had for us. So right now, we want everybody to stop. Stop what you're doing. We want you to go press that button. That that what that that, that one up. two no that one two three four five letter word. Sure, press it. Sure, hit it. Everybody in your contacts. I bet you won't. If you did it, text me. Not text me. Uh, DM me and send your cash out. But you got to show proof that you shared. Of course, it. to your whole. Don't just. Um, check all the boxes in your contacts, and then be like, 
oh yeah, this it. And then just erase it. Nah, I want to see the scent joint. Scent. And we need 50 of better shares per person. Oh yeah, we ever do that. You don't know what you gonna get. Up. Yeah. For real. For real. It's Christmas time, that's all I'm gonna say. It's free. It's free to share. Well, my grandma. And I ain't cheap, baby. Okay. <laughs> yeah, grandma, grandma was very inspirational. Yeah, you know, really. she was very loving. A grandmother that you would want. She loved to bake. And she loved, she could make you feel so good. Yeah. She would pray for you. And very encouraged. Sweet little lady. You know sweet how you got that little lady? lady. Yeah, yeah, she was a little sweet little lady. <laughs> yeah. So y'all help us get seen. She said she wanted the world to see us. And she just loved to us, y'all. When she first met him, she said, oh, shut up. He's a cute little boy out there waiting on you. She woke me up. <laughs> That's what the grandma said. Cute little boy out there waiting on Rest you, girl. Ooh, you he's know. cute. And me and her tight, so she know I ain't disrespecting her at all right now. But, yeah. But she loved him. He came back home. He was all swole up. Masculine. You was, you was real swole. That's what you saying now. I'm not saying nothing. Saying I look thin. No, you that you cut up now. I'm cut up well. <laughs> you you cut said up. I was big. You cut up. Well, you like you know you was swole. You was swole, uh -huh. honey. Y'all, he was swole. He had that old fat neck, shoulders out there. I'm telling you, he was. So what I am now, baby? You all of that. Neck, shoulders <laughs> in there. God damn. <laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> Baby, you was not like that. She made me so insecure <laughs> in myself, and I just said, "You wasn't." I feel like I haven't lost a little weight. You know what I'm saying? Coming down low, y'all think you both lost some weight? I know I have. He looked good. Baby, you know you was thicker than that. What I'm, what I am now. Though. You thin. thick. I'm just thin. Like a thin. No, man. you still thick. I said you a thicker. I mean, hold on. Let's stop using the word thick. You was healthy. Bigger. Healthier. Yeah. You was a macho. Yeah. So what I'm not a macho man? You are. Yeah, he need to stop. Stop no, playing. She got me insecure. She got my veins coming all out and shit. Making me want to go in there and work out right now. Get real, come out the tank top with one arm, you know what I'm saying? Y'all, he's, he's definitely finna be my person. Then she gonna be like, you know, like, yeah, got you back. Y'all, we need to stop. About 10 more push up. <laughs> I know they're like 10. Like, I need to stop at working out, though. I ain't worked out in a long time, so you ain't even got to ask in the comments, do I work out? He don't. He's natural. I don't. But I need to start back though. Be natural. Like physically working out dedicated to a workout plan. I ain't talking about no 10 push ups here. You know what I'm saying? I might hit like 10 push ups once a month. I ain't going to say 10. I mean like 25 push ups like once a month. In some random mode type. Of, you know, just get my blood flowing. Right. But not all the time. I don't do that often. He's gonna be but like a full time. workout though. It was like no exaggeration. Cause like when I came home, by twelve years. I I that say you worked out? I say about eleven years. That you was came, working out? Well, yeah, cause when I came, home, I worked out for a couple months. You know, so I was still in that mode. But after that, that was it. Oh, you saying you haven't worked out in about twelve years? Yeah. No. Like a, a, a full serious workout? You used to work out when Kwame was a baby. Really? Yes, you had the weights and all that. Oh, God dang it. Surfing. Hey, boy, y'all. Uh, 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 uh. That was about seven years ago. About seven. Still a long time. It's still time. a long time. That sounds so depressing. I, I try to make you sound and good. And he, he's. And <laughs> Damn, I try to make it sound good. But it's just seven years. Yeah, I need to tighten up. I'm going to tighten up, y'all. Would y'all like to see us do workout videos? Yeah. Because um, we do have another channel, which is LA Fitness and Boutiques by Nene. 
and he's yeah. going to be my personal trainer. He is my personal trainer. Yeah, if anybody out there need a personal trainer, hey, he, boy, I'm cute. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, come on. Mm. But yeah. Y'all heard he said he was just playing now. Yeah. Don't be commenting over. Thank y'all so much for respecting us as a couple. You know, there are so many people that hit be be hitting people up in their DMs and stuff like that. Be trying folks. Nobody has tried us. And please don't start. Yeah, don't. don't start please don't we've been doing good y'all for real so yeah. we, i thank y'all for being wrong because i'm a respect. different type of guy i'm not one of them <laughs> <laughs> I, don't let you too. Nah, I ain't gonna go there but yeah yeah and trust me yeah. i'm not who you think i'm who you think i am but i can't turn up please believe me go ahead with all that but we're not because we god fearing people we we doing yeah. better so we Just don't get that shit that's crazy. behind us how we used to, you know but you know anyway we we like we drama free like for real a lot of people say that but no we for real we're drama free over here i pray for you i don't even know how to go I used to. I used to blow them bitch out. Oh, he on. did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Don't hurt yourself. Alright. And again, this is uh she We I just bought another one which is red. So this is our blue room. And if it, this is video is not for anyone that's under under age eighteen. Yes. I think they we were going to drinking smoking. or drinking. smoking to right. underage, you know, minors. That's right. Or sex. That's right. No. Yeah. Wait till you marry. It'll feel so much better. You'll be so I proud promise. of yourself. I promise. Yeah. And make sure you have the right I know, person. Like, well, you know, you ain't waiting. I mean, I did. The mindset. If you sit there and think. He'll wait for you, and she will too. Like, I ain't that John would have been like, cause <coughs> anyway, yeah, we, that's a whole other topic. You might as well not even talk while you holding that in your hand. I ain't saying that, cause I'm straight. <laughs> hold on, y'all. Hold on. All right, y'all. Right. It's your boy Q. And it's your girl Dina Nini. And it's time to go to bed. Yes, and we gone. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's time to go to bed. <laughs> we gone. All right, y'all. Until next time. Enjoy, y'all. Love y'all. We out. Hey, play out. Here comes Santa Claus. Right down Santa Claus Lane. Hey, play out. Right down Santa Claus Lane. Hey, play out. People that you love the most, just make sure you got a club. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, rock.